Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Y'all know I love a good fake scalp unit. Today I'm gonna be showing you all a new method using a wow African unit that might be better than fake scalp, but we're gonna get into that in a moment. Now this wig is an Italian yakki unit, but it has a kinky straight look to it. And I'm all about that because I do have a kinkier texture. So this is gonna look like my hair when it's blown out, possibly even if I straighten it, it'll look like this. It does come with combs on the inside and a thick elastic band with their brand name on it. I'm putting it on to see if it fits and it does and y'all this hair looks like it could be my hair in like a few years in Jesus name. <laughs> so this is what the parting space looks like. I believe you get about four or five inches of parting. This hair feels super soft. Putting it on the mannequin head so that you all can see what it looks like up close. This is what the pre-plugged hairline looks like. It has been pre-plugged minimally but you can go in and customize it to your liking. I'm showing you all the parting space now. I believe it may be four inches of parting space and I did get my unit in length 20. I also got it in 130% density but it is very full. I love that. So at this point I was about to cut the lace off but then I remember that I had not tinted the lace so I decided to grab my 3d face creator this is a combination foundation and concealer duo and I used I believe level 14 I'll be sure to put it in the description box but this is transparent lace so it is going to be a lace that you can easily modify and get to be the same color as your scalp so I'm using this in order to modify it so that it's more so my scalp color you got the summertime love I work for your heart all night to the dawn you stay now I'm going to put the unit on to show you all what it looks like if you were to wear it glueless. So I'm using the elastic band and I'm wrapping that around the nape of my head and then pulling the unit forward. After doing this, you will notice that it lays super flat in the front. Now the sides are going to have some lifting, but if you were to wear it with the middle part, you wouldn't have to worry about putting any type of glue or adhesive because it lays so well and it looks really natural. Now you can see the sides, they're lifting, but I've shown numerous glueless methods on my channel to showcase how you can wear it glueless, but today I'm actually gonna secure it down. But look how good it looks even without having done so. It looks really great, but when that wind blows, the sides are definitely gonna lift up. So right now I'm just showing you all what the lace looks like, also that you can see tiny grids and that's generally what happens when you use transparent lace the grids are smaller as well as the knots they're much smaller so as you can see the knots have been bleached it looks good but if we put something like fake scalp under or what i'm going to show you all today which is these medical silicone scar removal sheets these are similar to Scarway, it's just a different brand. So you just open up the pack and this is what it looks like guys. It literally looks like scalp. This is such a game changing idea and it's super simple to apply. So I'm just removing the adhesive back and I'm just gonna turn my unit over so that the lace is exposed. And then whatever area you're gonna wear your part in, whether that be in the center or on the side, you're gonna place the silicone strip. Now, as you can see, I left about a few centimeters from the start of the hairline open. I didn't apply it directly on the hairline. I believe you should be able to get as close as possible, but I didn't do so. I may try that the next time that I use this method. Now you are gonna have to use more than one. So I just opened up another pack and used maybe a third of the next one in order to make sure that my part was fully covered. Now looking at it up close, it fills in that part so well and it looks really scalp-like. You also no longer see those grids. Now I'm gonna show you all in a moment how you can alter the color of the silicone tape that we use because it is a little light for my skin tone. Now I'm just gonna put it back on and show you all what it looks like now. After putting it on, if you wear a side part, you are gonna be able to see the strip through the lace, but I'm gonna show you guys how to fix that. Now as you press in, it's gonna kind of mold into the lace and it's gonna look like it's literally your scalp. <laughs> so right now you're just gonna see me playing around with it, adjusting the part and just making sure that I've pressed in so that it looks as natural as possible. I pull up to your spot in the evening Got a life in a pop for the weekend Girl, I said you're the one and I made it I made it I told my baby we can do what you want Take the stress away from what you've been going through Girl, there's one thing on my mind and it's all with you Yeah, it's all with you Feet up, palm trees, sundress, daiquiri Where you look at me is staggering
Now, if the color doesn't work for you, you can always just go in with your concealer, which is what I'm doing right now. I know you're the one. They go and they come. You like the summer breeze. Do the trees. You like the getaway. Shooting me. You like the summertime love. You like the summertime love. Y'all, look how realistic this looks. I believe lovely Brianna came up with this method. It's such a great idea. Thanks, girl. So right now, I'm just gonna secure it down using my handy dandy bed head. I absolutely love this holding spray because it's so easy to apply and it dries really fast. This wig is looking so good. So right now I'm just cutting some baby hair and I'm gonna begin to mold those because I have a low hairline. So I generally have to cover that area just to make sure it looks natural. But if you're someone who doesn't have a low hairline, you absolutely do not have to add baby hair. This is a great wig for wearing no baby hair. So just do whatever works for you. Baby, 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 baby. You driving me wild, you driving me so crazy. Got me acting out, got me trying to stay sober. Got me trying to stay sober. Wanted to your love, and I'm out here hungover. Hey, 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 hey. You made me want to take you to London, Paris. Make some times with yeah. cherries. Maybe there's no comparing to you. Don't need Keisha you. caring. Don't want begging, yeah. sharing. Yeah. Girl, I swear that it ain't fair. It ain't fair. Y'all, this hair looks so realistic, it's crazy. This is such a great unit for a natural hair girl that wants a protective style because it mimics our texture so perfectly. It's so bouncy and soft. I love the length and everything, but a bob would be absolutely amazing in this texture as well, especially for the summertime. I also cannot believe that this is only 130% density. Like it definitely looks like 150. It looks so great, y'all. Well, that's pretty much the end of this tutorial. I hope that you all thoroughly enjoyed it. Be sure to check the description box for all the 
links and specifications for this unit. I'll also link all the products that I use. Let me know if you all have tried the scar away method. Let me know your thoughts. Do you all think that this method is better than the fake scalp method? I look forward to hearing what y'all think. I'll be sure to link what I use in the description box as well. I look forward to your comments and feedback. Oh, this looks great. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you all in my next tutorial. Bye guys. Girl, I swear.